for the private bidder. So it looks like we were on our first signing of the January transfer window. Robin Olsen, uh, coming from Sheffield United on loan to the end of the season. Uh, as a, I, I think he, he's definitely going to be our second goalkeeper. I mean, um, I'd like to say Jed Steer is still our second, but then again, uh, Robin Olsen's obviously got more experience. So yeah, we're just going to talk about him for a second because um, I don't feel like there's much to say except from it's. I don't know if we really needed one, but then again, it's just it's nice to have a goalkeeper like him who's got experience. I mean, he's, he has got experience. He's played for Sweden. Uh, Roma, obviously Sheffield United. I'm not too sure how many games he's played for them, but you know he's he's a decent goalkeeper, and um, you know I'm I'm, I'm happy to have him. I mean, it's only to the end of the season. I I, I can't see us really bonging him at the end, or even him playing at all. I really can't see him playing at all. The only way he's going to be playing now, because obviously we're out of any other competition. Um, if 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 Martinez gets some sort of injury, but it's highly unlikely, but. I'm alright with this one. I mean, I've always liked Olsen. Honestly, I've always liked him. And, um, you know, it's nice to obviously have a backup goalkeeper like him, who's obviously got the experience he has. Because, um, but then then again, there is a bit of a, a problem because at Sheffield United, I think he was getting a bit of game time. Uh, obviously, still competing. I'm not too sure who their first goalkeeper is, but he's still competing uh, for, obviously, the, the first team. But with us, I just I can't see us like seeing the team sheet one of these days coming up where he's starting at all, like him coming off because it, I don't know, it's just Martinez, just he, he just secures the goalkeeping position. But you know, I'm not, I can't say. Uh, I don't know. It's just it just feels like we we don't really need one, if you know what I mean. And I don't like saying that, but then again, um, it's not like we just bought a shit goalkeeper on loan, if you know what I mean. But yeah. That's our third uh, January transfer signing. Hopefully, we can still go for Basuma uh, or someone in the midfield. We need we need a midfielder uh, to just end this amazing January transfer window because you know we've already got the likes of Coutinho, Luca Dean, Robin Olsen, and uh, you know they're not all small names. And I was watching uh, Perzo's interview after the Man U game. He said Gerard has asked to bring in proven winners. Uh, and he doesn't matter about age. He, he he doesn't really want to go for like the younger sorts, and I love that. Um, you know, I mean, Luis Gadin and obviously Coutinho. That speaks out for himself, and that's that's basically what we've got him in. Um, and yeah, I'm all for that. If they've you know they've they've all got a taste of winning something, so they come to us. We've got a better chance of getting into that top seven. So yeah, that's gonna be in the video, guys. Uh, January transfer window is going really good for us, by the way. And uh, I think we will be getting that one more sign. I can't see us getting five, but I do believe we will get a midfielder. So yeah, up to Villa with a prize Villa. We'll see you in the next video.